Hello you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's great to see you all here. Oh my god, it's been like maybe I think been like a month right now. I haven't just got the camera all by myself and talking, chatting, doing something like that. It's great. I feel the energy and great sense to do this video right now, definitely. Well, if you are new in my channel, welcome to you all. My name is Hulia and I am a Turkish girl who lives in Istanbul, in a very big city in Turkey. And I do different content videos in this channel. I share my local life, I share my lifestyle, my work life, my education life, and as well as um, my enjoyable life things sometimes. One of them is definitely a thrifting. I love thrifting and definitely want to share with you guys all. Um, I think it was my last video or before the last video I promise you guys to do a thrifting haul in this channel and today is a day I can say today I am gonna share with you my very best thrifting pieces these pieces are not the recent pieces I can say I got some um, from different places uh, for about I think um, three weeks ago or a month ago and this week also I did very good thrifting and I collect them all and I just brought here to share with you guys all if you're really interested in thrifting things you definitely understand my feelings about thrifting why I do this thrifting as an obsession <laughs> well um, this is not an obsession I can say but if you find really quality things it becomes real obsessions this is not the thing I can do only for cheap prices I find as a thrifting pieces and buy this is also a life thing I can say you know just you know in fashion or other you know sectors I can say in fields this capitalism thing is definitely game-changing thing and it definitely force us to produce produce and produce we become a consumer monsters here so this have to be changed well um, I am one of those idea keepers um, that who loves thrifting and who loves you know sharing the idea of using secondhand stuff and just you know um, level level down or I can say the the balanced the producing level in our world in our earth well one by one I'm gonna show you all thrifting pieces I have clothes I have home stuff or I have kind of stationary things I can say um, well let's get started very first piece I'm gonna share with you a neat um, if you like neat for your things, you definitely will love this color. This neat color is so great. It is really soft material, I can say. You um, normally buy them for 60, 70 or over, you know, 100 Turkish shiras in local, um, you know, shops. Well, I got it for only 5 Turkish Liras. Can you believe this? This beautiful knitwear is only 5 Turkish Liras. The second piece is more like a manwear thing or manwear sweater or I can say um, what, what we call it. It's sweater, right? This kind of um, material it has maybe you can you know see here or yes it is really soft it is so oversized but guys it's it definitely looks perfect on me yes after wearing this men sweater you can see how it looks on me. I'm obsessed with this really soft and you know simple. I really like this stuff. Well, another piece is one sweater jacket or I can say without button jacket. <laughs> Whatever you call for it. it's a basic sweater I can say. And this is very really special one guys because it is 
freaking river island sweater oh my god i never seen the sweater before in local bazaars it's so soft and i definitely feel the quality and it just perfectly fits on me i can wear it day and out and it just looks so pretty um, color is also very nice it's not like total red color maybe you see some red or pink color on um, camera but it's kind of like we call it pomegranate color here you can see it's so soft and hmm, lovely I can say just bought this week thrift haul as a thrift haul here it's so simple and handmade um, crochet bag I can say it's not a big one I can wear it this way when we go you know markets or I can say um, going you know the local places or near places I can only just put my um, mobile phone or my purse in it and then I can wear it as a simple pieces and I obsessed with it I definitely love the color and how they you know stitched it how they definitely crocheted it looks a little bit shape fade but <laughs> it's because of the I think they keep this in a very you know irregular shape like that when they were they, before they were selling so that's why it's a little bit need a shape but after you know putting all purse and everything in it it definitely just have the shape here but it's just you know simple and i definitely love its looseness and everything here i don't know if you have ever watched a thrifting video in a Turkish channel and Turkish means like the, the person who is Turkish but doing an English you know um, videos in her channel or his channel the thrifting is thrifting word thrifting is not very popular in Turkey but it depends what you know cities whether it is big city or a small city it definitely change um, in Istanbul, it's a really big city and people really know about thrifting and they love doing this thrifting stuff in local bazaars, local shops and that is really great because for me, um, in the very first time, I think it was three or four years ago, I don't remember clearly, when I just came to Istanbul, I was one of the, you know, um, the very important thing uh, was for me to find a very you know um, different style places or local shops that I can go and shop or doing do shopping and um, I don't go and buy really expensive stuff I really love to buy cheap things but also it should be the, the, the product should be very quality one and very you know useful also search the digital platforms that how I can you know um, do this thrifting thing online and online thing is also um, available in Turkey we have different kind of um, platforms like Dolop or Gardrop or what was let's go yes these three um websites or i can say online platforms um give this opportunity you to um do online shopping as a thrifting or secondhand shopping but i beside having this joy of doing thrifting on these platforms i also love going the local places i definitely want to see the real things and want to touch them and want to you know hand them and this was my thing but that's why i search all local places local bazaars to do thrifting in Istanbul and this piece is all from there like what I got here as a thrifting pieces I got from very local places very local bazaars in Istanbul this is not a recent piece it's been maybe for almost more than three or four months now 
um, but I haven't shown these pieces in my vlog so it's really special and it's really really unique for me I wanted to share with you guys this piece is as you can hear or as you can see here it's a photo album there is photo album um, spaces you can put your photos I was planning to sell this on you know online shopping or um, even in local bazaars it would be definitely a great price because people love this kind of unique things and they can't find easily and then I thought why not I'm using this why not I collect my own family photo album here and keep it forever well that's why I just grabbed it and it was this this pieces were out of the you know this kind of book thing I um, glued it and I, it's just reshaped again here this looks so pretty and lovely there is a eleven and his or her her baby of course and her baby it's kind of family thing you just feel in your heart so I'm definitely keeping it for forever and this piece is definitely from one of them I just grabbed yesterday it's a photo frame and it has really this kind of um, details on it it's real bamboo made photo album I think I'm gonna put um, our you know photo with my um, husband here so let's see how I'm gonna style it I'm not sure another unique piece is I can literally say is this black winter dress that I grabbed two weeks ago as you can see here it's not a long very long dress it just comes to my just you know four no or two or three finger up to my knees and it has this neck here kind of turtleneck but really soft material it has and I'm definitely planning to wear it with the black you know socks the long socks so I think it will look so unique and very you know I can say um, simple but very chic this beautiful beautiful vintage shirt that I thrifted recently looking so beautiful my mother was having this kind of stuff when she was young I grabbed one or two pieces from her um, but they were all gone I think I don't know where they're gone but this time when I just saw this I definitely remembered my mother's dresses and things so I wanted to have in my wardrobe as a one unique vintage shirt that I definitely want to style well it's now very interesting time because I show you my coats my short coats I can say that I grabbed recently they were kind of same because they have the same color chocolate brown or I can say they are really looking beautiful and I a couple of times styled them I wear them outside I never seen uh, them on different people that's why I feel a little bit unique on myself well one of the coats is this brown I can say dark brown or chocolate brown color um, not real leather of course it's artificial leather you can say it's a little bit I think oversized but still I love wearing it because I don't know my style definitely goes with oversized things all the time like you can see here I definitely wear it with everything it looks so unique and I wear it with black jeans a blue jeans I don't know how much I would pay for this kind of thing in person in normal you know local shops but in thrifting I only paid 15 Turkish rias for that 
Well, another thing is, again, chocolate brown coat with this kind of different details on it. You can see here. Oh my God, this looks so pretty. Let me just bear it and show you guys how it looks. It's so beautiful. I definitely love this hat here. And you kind of feel the old vibes in it and you can wear it in autumn season even in winter um i all the time wear my um wool um coat because it definitely warms me up but sometimes when the weather is really rainy i don't want to wear the wool made coat these are more appropriate for that and i definitely keep wearing this when the weather becomes really rainy or a little bit chill well now the last but not least item i'm gonna show you guys that i thrifted a month ago i definitely remember the exact thing because when i saw this baby i was totally obsessed with it i told you i'm really obsessed with this color definitely with this color it's a tab of color and you can wear it and you can style it with everything. I was just sitting in there and I just um, asked a local seller man and he said, it's only 50 Turkish euros. I said, what? And I was in shock and I said, okay, I'm buying it. It's so unique. It's definitely beautiful. It has no marks or it's not first used, so it's a little bit here, maybe damaged, but it's nothing. Even using this beautiful bag was so simple and very spacious, you know, um, usable spaces in it. That's why I couldn't just say no for this beauty and I wanted to grab it. Well guys, thank you so much for watching my YouTube videos. This video was really, you know, beautiful. One of the very beautiful videos for me.